Hello everyone, I am Vatsal, welcome you all to my channel and today I am going to show you how to do networking between two computers. So there are three steps involved in this. The first step is the physical connectivity between the two computers using a LAN cable. Then the second step would be to assign the IP addresses to both the system. And the third step would be to share a common folder. So let's see the step number one. So in step one, what you have to do is you have to connect this Ethernet cable or the LAN cable to your computer. So this is the port where you have to connect it. This is called RJ45 port or the LAN port. This will be there in your laptop or PC. So just look out for this port RJ45 port and insert one end of this LAN cable in PC1 and the other end of that cable in PC2. So this is how the setup will look like. So you can see that the one end is connected in LAN port of PC1 and the other end is connected in PC2. After the connectivity is done, what you have to do is you have to assign the IP address. And to do so, what you have to do is just go to this network icon in the taskbar right click over it and just click on this option open network and sharing center now just click on this option change adapter settings and then click on this local area connection and it will be written like realtek pci something like that just click on it right click over it click on properties option now in this window just click on this internet protocol version 4 and then click on this properties button. Now choose this option use the following IP address and give the IP address that I am typing right now. Just click once in this field subnet mask and it will automatically fill it. Then just click in the default gateway field and just type the IP address 192.168.1.1 and in the preferred DNS server just type this IP address and in alternate DNS server just type 8844 after Entering the IP address 192.168.1.2 in the first PC, just click on the OK button. Click on the close button and close this window. So now you have assigned the IP address 192.168.1.2 to the PC1. Now we will move to the PC2 to assign the IP address to that system. So now we are on PC number two. Uh, just go to this network icon in the taskbar, right click over it and just click on this option open network and internet settings. Uh, just click on this option change adapter options. And now just click on this ethernet adapter. So it will be Realtek PCI GBE family controller something like that. Right click over it click on properties option click on yes now in this window just click on this internet protocol version 4 then click on properties button then choose this option use the following IP address and now just give this IP address to the system 192 192.168.1.3 just click once in this subnet mask field and it will automatically fill it. Now go to this gateway field and just type 192.168.1.1 and in this preferred DNS server just type 888 and in alternate DNS just type 884 after this just click on the ok button click on the close button 
So now you have assigned the IP address 192.168.1.3 to PC number 2. Now for the communication to take place between these two PC, we have to check one thing in both the system. So just go to the search bar and type control panel. Now in this window, just make sure that the view by should be category here. And after this, just click on network and internet option. Then click on network and sharing center. And then in the left hand side, just click on this option, change advanced sharing settings. Now for the current profile or the public profile, under network discovery, make sure that this option is selected. Turn on network discovery and under file and printer sharing, this option should be selected. Turn on file and printer sharing. Just make sure that these two options are selected. If they are not, then just select them and then just click on the save changes button and then close this window. So I will now move to PC number one to check the same thing. So now I am on PC number one and just go to the search bar and type control panel. Just click on the search result control panel. Click on network and internet, then click on network and sharing center. Then click on this link, change advanced sharing settings. And for the current profile or the public profile, just make sure that under network discovery, this option should be checked. Turn on network discovery and under file and printer sharing, this option turn on file and printer sharing should be checked. If they are not checked, then just select them and then just click on the save changes button and then close this window. Now I will move to the step number three and will create a share folder. So just right click, go to new and then just click on this folder. Give it a name, whatever name you want to give. I will put this file, sample file in this folder. And now I will share this folder. Just right click over this folder. Click on properties option, then go to this sharing tab, click on this button advanced sharing. Just check mark this share this folder option and then go to permissions. Just click on this permissions button. Just check this full control. Just check for full control, change, read. Just check under allow and after this just click on the apply button, click on OK button. After this just click on the apply button, click on OK button. So now this collaborate folder is now shared and this is the folder that we are going to access on our PC number 2. So now we will move to the PC number 2 to see whether the networking is working or not. So now we are on PC number two and I will show you how to map that shared folder on this PC. Just click on this PC option in the taskbar. Now just click on this computer tab and then just click on this map network drive option. And now just type backslash two times and type the IP address of PC number one. That is 192.168.1.2. After that, just type backslash once again and just type the name of that shared folder. After this, just click on the finish button. So you can see that the file is here we can access it also and we have successfully accessed this shared folder.
and the networking is working perfectly fine. So whenever you have to access that shared folder just click on this PC and you can just go to this shared folder and access whatever documents you want to access. Similarly if you wish to share documents from this PC number 2 then just put all the files that you want to share with the other PC here in this collaborate folder. So this is how you can do networking between two computers. So that's it from my side. If you like my video, you can click on the like button and subscribe to my channel. Thanks for watching.